Imagine your baby is injured in the delivery room due to medical malpractice. The state promises you a lifetime of care only to find out years later that fund for that care is running out of money. CBS2 investigative reporter Masa Saidi is asking the state how they plan to keep that promise. At birth, Chase Sadowski suffered a neurological injury, severely impairing his motor skills. Now 17 for Chase to get from one level of the house to the other, two aides have to carry him up and down the stairs. A lift paid for by New York's medical indemnity fund is broken. Chase feels trapped and he blames the fund. It's hard to put into words the emotions that I feel besides straight anger because of how much was taken from me. Typically, patients who sue for malpractice and win get a substantial award. But in New York, the hospital or doctor found to be negligent is only on the hook for part of the damages. Instead of paying for future costs, New York enrolls these kids into the fund with the promise of a lifetime of care. I just feel we were lied to. The New York Department of Health oversees the fund. During a state budget hearing in January, Senator Liz Kruger asked DOH about the future. We have a legal obligation to the children that are in the fund. We have not stopped enrollment, and if we did, we would be we, we would notify you. But four months later, why wasn't anyone told? DOH quietly stopped enrolling new applicants. Anxious families tell CBS2 Investigates they only found out by reading a notice on the state's website. So, Masa, what is the status of this fund so these families can get some relief? Such a heartbreaking story. So, Christine, the governor put $58 million into the fund. That money is going to last until next spring, and it's really a question mark what's going to happen after that. Back when this deal was hatched up in 2011, the senator tells me that hospitals agreed to largely finance this fund. But at 11 tonight, I'll tell you who's been forced to pick up the tab lately. Okay. I might have a guess, but we'll yeah. wait till 11, Masa. We'll see you then.